Okay, so I'm Tiffany. I'm one of the instructors here with Alpha Drones USA, and we work closely with the students to uh, get them to acquire the knowledge so that they can then pass their Part 107 license to become drone pilot licensed. Well, working with Alpha Drones, we typically start off courses that uh, begin in length of six weeks, and they can be tailored to extend to up to seven or eight weeks, depending on the population. Uh, we really wanna work hard to ensure the success of, of our students, to ensure that they, they pass the licensure exam to become drone pilots. Mm -hmm. And so, depending on the market, we will tailor a schedule to provide them with success. So the test is 60 questions. You have two hours to take that. Um, you will take it in a PSI facility. Uh, they take all of your um, your phone and things of that nature mm -hmm. beforehand. You enter into the testing facility. You are sitting down in the facility taking the exam on a computer uh, for a two hour duration. Once you pass the test, you then have to apply for the license. Okay. And, and that's simply it. You go onto the FAA website with um, a code, a specific code that you'll receive upon passing the exam to then register for your drone pilot license. Right, and how long does it take for them to realize if they passed or not? Oh, immediately. As okay. soon as you uh, finish the exam, you get a, a printout of your score and the questions that you got wrong. Well, at Alpha, we use a program called King Schools and that comes with a comprehensive curriculum that includes all the content that you will need in order to understand and be able to answer the questions. And with that curriculum comes a series of questions that students um, are accept have accessibility to, to practice over and over and over in preparation for taking the exam. Right. Uh, once you become drone pilot licensed, you'll then move on to phase two. Phase two is where you learn how to operate a specific fleet of drones. Mm -hmm. And uh, we have various fleets offered here at Alpha, uh, but one, more of the popular fleets that are running are Fleet One, Fleet Two, Fleet Three. Fleet One um, is, this, is specific to agricultural business. It's called the AgriDrone. Uh, fleet Two, we use to do cleanings of buildings. So we use the C1 cleaning drone. And then fleet three is used for videography, things of that nature. And so depending on your interests, you'll then move on to phase two, depending on which uh, fleet you'd like to learn. Uh, once you learn that specific fleet, you'll go on, you'll do your, your ground school training, which means you're in class, um, on the ground, in a classroom, whether it's a virtual classroom or in a physical classroom setting to learn how to operate that specific drone. And then you go to flight school where you will physically learn how to fly that drone in the air um, and learn to operate it under different sort of conditions. Uh, once completing phase two, you then move on to phase three, which is your internship. And at Alpha, you are required to complete 25 hours of internship hours in order to then move on to phase four, which is employment. All right, job placement. Okay. And just for any further questions, they can always go to the website. What's the website again? The web website is alphadronesusa.com. All right. Well, thank you very much. All right. <laughs>